Big Sky Outdoors, powered by Town Pump, fueling your next outdoor adventure, is also brought to you by Counter Assault, your ultimate protection in the wild. Montana Army Navy, get it, get out, and live it. Glacier Real Estate, your real estate connection to Northwest Montana. And the Outdoor Report is provided by Montana Fish, Wildlife, and Parks. Thanks for joining us this week on Big Sky Outdoors. I'm Matt Ray along with Joel Stevenson and his kids. And it's the middle of August, it's the middle of summer, and we're gonna go creek fishing today. We're gonna be throwing mainly terrestrials, hoppers, beetles, ants. I'm gonna show you some of the new patterns from the Montana Fly Company that have come out this year, and it should be a great time. Should we go hit it? Let's do it, Let's do it. it. dark water straight out in front of you. There's a fish. August and just about anywhere you walk around in Montana if you walk through the grass you're gonna be kicking up grasshoppers. We're here in the mountains we're fishing with grasshoppers, crickets and ants to see if we can't get some of these nice cutthroats that are in these little streams. little mountain cutthroat um, took an ant pattern. Great day fishing here in, uh, in the mountains. Look how beautiful he is. Nice, that was a fun one. Let's go get another one. You know on a lot of these high mountain streams, you know, the, the water is too shallow in a lot of places to hold fish, but every now and then the, the stream will flow down and make a bend, and there's usually a deeper hole in those sections, and a lot of times there's some bedrock that's sitting right there, and you see there's sort of seams in the bedrock, and that's where the fish like to lay. They lay there, and they wait for um, the opportunity for something to come floating by, and we just try to, try to put our bugs, whatever we're fishing with, hoppers or ants or beetles, put them right over those areas, and the fish will come up and grab So this water I'm in right now is, it's just a, the tail out, um, kind of rocky, ripply, below a deeper hole that we were in. I caught this fish in this deeper hole. The fish kind of ran out into this uh, real shallow, ripply water, but the fish in these high mountain streams like to hold in the deeper holes. You don't usually find the fish too much in the shallower water. Nice healthy cutthroat on a, a black ant. Nice! <laughs> Big Sky Outdoors is brought to you locally by your Montana Honda dealers, and by Parkside Credit Union. At Town Pump, we appreciate the opportunity to serve you and give back to the communities we live in. Come check out our expanded wine areas with a great selection and low prices. This month's specials include any size fountain drink for only $1, deli burritos are two for $2.22, and Bud and Bud Light 18 packs of cans and bottles are only $14.99. Thank you for supporting our Montana-owned and operated Town Pump stores, fueling your Montana adventures since 1953. Town
Glacier Real Estate understands why you live, work, and play in Northwest Montana. Let Tim Gravel and Kenyon Matheson help you buy or sell your next piece of the Montana dream. Call Tim or Kenyon of Glacier Real Estate today. I'd floated this fly through this little deep section a couple times and fish came up and hit a different fly that I had. Didn't hit it, I never felt him touch it, but he looked at it. So I switched flies to a little foam beetle and uh, second cast, third cast, he came up and nailed it hard. Uh, beautiful fish. Beautiful little high mountain cutthroat. While the guys are out fishing the creek for cutthroat trout, I thought it'd be good to show you some of the patterns we're using today. These are all from the Montana Fly Company, based right here in Montana. They're top quality flies. You can't go wrong with these patterns. They're a lot of fun to throw, and they catch fish. Well, let's first talk about some of the ant patterns we're gonna be throwing today. You know, ants are probably some of the most common terrestrial insects that trout will be eating during the summer months. We've been throwing some of the, the more common foam ant, you know, a size 18 with a great little yellow indicator on it. Uh, trout love these. Um, they're used to eating them all day long in the, in the rivers and streams, so they're a great pattern to throw. One of my favorite ant patterns that I've been throwing not only this year, but last as well, is Eric's para ant. Uh, it's a cinnamon black color, and this is such a great pattern. It floats really super high on the water, really easy to see, and catches a lot of fish. And the other ant pattern that we've been using today is called the Silverman Sparkle Ant. It's a little bit bigger pattern, mimps a flying ant, rides really high on the water. It's super easy to see. It's got the nice pink indicator on top. Uh, so as you throw it into the riffles and whatnot, it's really easy to see and, and keep track of and, and catches a lot of fish. It's a good pattern. We're also going to be throwing beetles today. There's a classic foam black beetle, uh, which everybody knows and loves. Montana Fly Company's got a great version of that. Nice bright yellow indicator on top to be able to see through the riffles. But they also have what's called the Jake's Gulp Beetle. This is my new favorite beetle pattern to throw anytime in the middle of the summer, even into early fall. It's got a nice red belly. Uh, they come in different sizes. It's got a nice orange indicator on top. Really super easy to see as you throw it through some of the riffles um, and some of the channels. Uh, great pattern, catches a lot of fish. And then a new pattern for this year is called the AJ's Beetle. This is a great looking pattern. It's a little bit bigger, but it comes in red, purple, and a variety of other colors. It looks buggy, it's gonna catch fish. So we're uh, coming up here on another really nice looking hole. Looks like it's gonna hold some nice fish. We're not seeing any rising, but we're gonna throw a, a big foam beetle up on there and drift it down through, right through the foam, foam line and see if we can catch a fish out of here. First cast up in here, I missed a really nice fish. I didn't even feel him on the hook, so I think we can get him again. I was just getting ready to cast up there again, saw a different fish rise, so I pulled up short, dropped it in lower than the, the first fish was, and uh, this guy nailed it. So we'll, we'll see what he is here pretty quick. Nice big fat mountain cutty.
eating beetles. In the big sky country, you have some big road trips and nothing's better than being behind the wheel of a Honda with real-time all-wheel drive. Honda HRV Pilot and CRV keep you safe with Honda Lane Watch and connected with Honda Link. For all the things you're into, an all wheel drive HRV can be yours for just $189 a month at your Montana Honda dealer. Honda, it's the perfect ride for Montana. Counter Assault, the original bear pepper spray and recipient of the Grizzly Bear Stewardship Award for Research and Development, is manufactured in Montana. I trusted Counter Assault as my first line of defense in bear management, investigations, and rescues following bear attacks. I know firsthand its effectiveness and spray time is important. Carry what the professionals carry. Counter Assault. Look for the red can. This is my day. My time. My dog. My home. My car. I know who I am and who I want to be. I take pride in my financial decisions. And at Parkside, I have a voice. This is my credit union. The next patterns I want to show you are probably some of my favorite. I love throwing hoppers. There's nothing more exciting to me to see a big trout come up and nail a large hopper right off the surface of the water. Montana Fly Company has got a lot of different versions of hoppers, everything from foam all the way to your standard and classic parachute hopper. A couple of new hopper patterns for this year is the Hollywood hopper, beautiful looking pattern, floats real high, super foamy, super buggy, it's going to catch fish. Also the Wands Little Hopper, it's a great little foam pattern, pink, it's got a pink indicator, white indicator on top, floats super high on the top of the water, it's going to catch a lot of fish this season. One more helpful hint when it comes to hopper fishing, I like to bring a variety of different markers, whether it's red, greens, whatever, that way I'm able to customize my hopper patterns to the stream and environment that I'm going to be fishing. Go into your local fly shop, take a look at the different assortment of hopper patterns that they have from the Montana Fly Company. You can't go wrong with any of these patterns. They're a blast of fish, they float high, and they're definitely gonna catch a lot of fish for you. Oh, yeah, that's a nice fish. Taking my time on this one, don't want to lose it. Just a pretty small fly. Nice fish. Took an amp. Nice fish. Good job, Sammy. A couple of other insects I want to mention, the spruce moth, great pattern to use this time of year, all the way through late July into August, even into early September, you got to have a few spruce moths in your repertoire. Also crickets, the MSC para cricket, great pattern, rides real high, super easy to see, you got to have a few crickets in your box as well. Again, the Montana Fly Company has a variety of great flies to use, go into your local fly shop, ask for Montana Fly Company flies, 
They'll set you up with the right flies, the right patterns to have a great day on the river. I like how you use your teeth to pull on your line. Savage. Learn that from Robin Hood. Nice little mountain cutty. Slipped right out of my fingers. Navy is your hunting headquarters. It's the best place around when you're serious about saving money on the things you need to go hunting. Knife sharpeners, wool gloves, backpacking meals, optics, socks, boots, insoles, stoves, why? It's a virtual hunter's checklist. All name brands and all at fantastic savings. On Highway 2 in Evergreen and Highway 93 in Whitefish. MontanaArmyNavy.com. Get out and live it. Glacier Real Estate understands why you live, work, and play in Northwest Montana. Let Tim Gravel and Kenyon Matheson help you buy or sell your next piece of the Montana dream. Call Tim or Kenyon of Glacier Real Estate today. Nice. Okay, work it down over, the, yeah, perfect. Good cast, let it run right down through there. Try right. Try up. Try to get it above that little bush right there. Oh. Yeah. Now watch. Just watch. Oh. There it is. Let it run if it needs to. Yeah. Let it go. Let it go if it needs to. Nice. Good job, buddy. Thanks. Keep your tip off like that. Okay, Daniel, you gotta hold this thing. Hold on to him so he might try to wiggle. Nice job, Daniel. Thanks. What'd you catch him on? An uh, ant, yeah. Cool. All right. Should okay, we let, let it go? Him, let him go here. Cool. Good job. Get another one, buddy. Okay. <laughs> This week's Outdoor Report from Montana Fish, Wildlife, and Parks is brought to you by Parkside Credit Union, the best place for the people of Western Montana to get a loan. More Montanans are camping this summer than in years past. And according to a recent national report, campers primarily want to stay at state and national parks. Last year, in 2016, we had a 6% increase over camping the, the prior year. So each year it has gone up pretty significantly. And I think just as stresses of everyday life, how much it is to travel possibly to other locations, it's a little bit more economic to stay close and explore the state. Many campers seek locations that offer a variety of recreational activities. I mean, most people are either out here to recreate boating with their boat to like pull their inner tubes and have a good time or fish. Helping drive that increase in camping are millennials who want to get out and access the outdoors in their own unique way especially in out-of-the-way places. So we do see some millennials, especially at some of our more remote parks. So if you wanted to do a backcountry camping experience, we have some of those opportunities available. And it seems like the millennials tend to, to like that. 
Camping offers the opportunity to disconnect from everyday life and enjoy the outdoors with family and friends. Our parks are a great way for people to get out, relax, unwind from their work weeks, just enjoy nature, just kind of get back to those basics. Even with the increase in campers this summer, Montana offers many places to get out and camp. I'm Grant Herzog, out among Montana's fish, wildlife, and parks. We just fished this hole with dries, and we got some nice ones. I thought it might be a good idea to throw on a sparkle minnow or just any type of streamer. Maybe see if there's some fish down there that maybe weren't looking up as much. And <laughs> as we were walking away, I casted out this sparkle minnow and I got that. <laughs> Look at that bad boy. Wow, that is cool. Well guys, that was a beautiful, fun day. It's all caught fish but me. <laughs> I was behind the camera, so what are you gonna do, right? But uh, yeah, great time, caught a lot of fish. Good job, guys. Thank you. All right, cool. All right, we'll do it again. We'll see you next time on Big Sky Outdoors.